This video is going to provide instructions on refilling your Lysol soap dispenser the quick and easy way. First off, I just wanted to say that I really like this product. Uh, it was fairly cheap, $6 from Walmart. Came with four AA batteries, which I haven't had to replace yet, and I've used it for over six months. Uh, the only downside to this product is that the refill bottles are fairly expensive, but with this video, uh, this should solve that problem. And with the method that I used to refill it, it's actually easier to refill this product than the manual pump type uh, soap dispensers. So let's, let's start off and uh, cover some of the items you'll need for this. You'll want to get a bottle of refill soap. Uh, this is a cheap product from Walmart. Uh, you can use whatever you prefer. And you'll also need a drill with a drill bit, or if you don't have access to that, you can use flathead screwdrivers. Now, the first thing you need to do is create two holes on the top of the refill bottle. Uh, the first hole, which is the larger one, is where you'll refill uh, the soap, and the second hole right there is the vent hole, and I will explain that as we proceed with refilling. If you don't have a drill bit, this is the way you would create the holes on the top of the bottle. You would start off with a small screwdriver, puncture the hole, and kind of twist the screwdriver around, and you can progressively work your way up with larger flathead screwdrivers until you get the hole big enough. And uh, you may have some plastic shavings fall into the bottle, but what you can do is just rinse it out with water until you get everything out of there. And once you have these holes created, what you want to make sure is that the larger hole will fit the spout of the refill bottle. This right there, you want to make sure these two uh, are about the same size um, so you can fit that spout into the hole. Um, and this is going to be the process you want to use. Um, you're going to line these up, turn it over, squeeze, release, pull the bottle off, and there you have it. You have your soap dispenser refilled, and you didn't create any kind of mess, you don't have any waste, you didn't have to turn the unit off, and as soon as you put your hand underneath, it's ready to dispense more soap. And if you want to seal up the hole in between refills, you can just take some tape and place it over the top, cover it up, put a little tab on there so you can take it off a little bit easier the next time around. And that's it. So if you don't feel like paying for the expensive Lysol refill bottles, this is going to be your solution here. This way you get to use whatever soap you like versus using the Lysol soap which doesn't produce a very good lather uh, when you're washing your hands. hope you liked this video. I hope you found it helpful and useful and uh, thanks for watching.